Hello everybody, this is another one of these videos. It's actually been a while since I've done one of these like going off on epic videos and they've always been received well. So I thought we'd do it again real quick before we get into the video. I just want to say our 1%, our new drop just came out a couple of days ago. It's only available for a little bit of time left. Go into the description, go grab some. It helps support me 1%, make the team bigger. It's so crazy how much 1% is grown, man, just in the past year so. It's there. I would appreciate it, but on to the video. So if you guys didn't see yesterday, we had a hashtag rip Fortnite trending. Now there's more to this, but the main reason for this is because Clicks, the big Fortnite streamer, arguably one of the biggest freaking creators right now. For a long time now, he's been doing wagers, which technically is gambling. If you guys don't know what a wager is, you basically bet to see if you can beat the other person. I put up $10, Clicks put up $10, he wins, he gets the whole thing, so he makes $10, he keeps $20. Now, I don't know the technicality of it, but Epic seems to think that this is gambling, and of course, a whole bunch of people that are wagering clicks are underage and can't gamble. Now, this thing's been going on for a long time in the Fortnite scene. It has always happened. And it seems like Epic is starting to crack down on wagers, which arguably, I would say, makes competitive even better, because I like watching people play for money but now it's not very clear but i think something that's going to happen in the future is epic's just going to ban gambling completely or wagering which means bye bye to this competitive funness and i understand epic's point of view but because this hashtag came up of hashtag rip fortnite a lot of people started eating into fortnite really hard now everybody saw this as an opportunity to really bash on epic and fortnite so everybody just hopped on of course the dumb wagon the dumb train of just hatred so people were making fun of everybody involved in fortnite the fortnite competitive scene that were trying to make it better but just seemed to not <laughs> and then we started having creators kind of pop out a little more and talk about why they're not liking fortnite and just before i get into this too i don't think it comes as a shock to anybody fortnite's been like this for quite a while now i mean we have had the biggest creators ever literally leaving the game ninja Tifu, C Day, Fearless, so many people, like I could go on and on, just so many people are leaving and have already left. And then we had Laserbeam talk about how he thinks the way that you have to craft things is boring and also the floor loot is just horrible. I agree. I think the crafting is a very cool idea, but it's not fun. <laughs> I've said this so many times and time again that everything that Fortnite has done in chapter two has just been a remake, a remodel, a retexture, whatever you want to call it, of something that has happened in chapter one. Every single bow that you see in the game right now, it's been in the game before. The shockwave bow, shockwaves. The stink bow, stinks. The flame bow from, you know, Dragon's Breath. And don't even get me started about the shotgun meta. I love that the punk is back, but I think you should be able to just have the pump on ground loot and not have to craft every single game. I get this could be like an alternate universe thing to, to chapter one and they're going along with the same storyline. So that's why everything's a remodel and retexture. I get that. I don't like it. Take it out. <laughs> the double jump boots that you can get in the game now. I think that's very cool. That's something pretty new and I like that. That's enjoyable. There's only one on the map. But as I said before, I really don't like the remodels, the retextures. There's so many things this game could do that they just don't do. I don't know why. <laughs> and just because it's one of those videos, I still believe skill-based matchmaking should go away. And I think instead of arena or whatever they want to do with arena, make a ranked system that gives incentive for people to grind it, like awards, pickaxes. Everybody freaked out when they had the FNCS winner pickaxe, acorn, 1% acorn, by the way, one. So he got it, but that's an incentive to grind and to get it, I would. I know I don't play in the best lobbies all the time. It's because I don't want to sweat. I hate it. It's boring. I hate it. <laughs> I want to keep playing the game, but ugh. also mobile. Mobile and it's hundreds of millions of players and Epic isn't talking about anything they're doing if it's coming back or what's going on there. I get it could be because of the lawsuit, but you're just letting tens of millions, hundreds of millions of players just wondering what's going to happen with Fortnite. Now, there was also a lot of people that were doing a hashtag thank you Fortnite just because this game, it's changed a whole bunch of people's lives. It's changed my life. It's changed so many people around me, their lives. Of course, I love it, but I, I can critique it. I can talk about it. I can hate it. I can like it. It doesn't matter. But a lot of people also took the opportunity to say thank you Fortnite for ruining Fortnite in whatever way they wanted to. Every single time I've done one of those videos, it's always ended up with I love the game and I want the game to keep growing and I want it to do better. 
and I talk about the things that I think would make it better. And sometimes it goes in that direction and then it just reels me back in. And I've said before, this game for me isn't a casual game anymore. I want to be able to come on the game and just play however I want, like with whoever I want to, but I can't do that anymore. I can't play with friends that barely play this game because if they play with me, they play the sweatiest of the sweats based off my stats. I can't play casually anymore. I want to. And LTMs, for example, the very beginning of this video that you saw in the Zone Wars clips, that's LTM is skill based. I can't play Floors Lava. I can't play Zone Wars. I can't play Sniper Shootout. I can't play anything without being in skill based matchmaking. And I have to say this so many times because everybody thinks we'll just go play a different game. Honestly, there's nothing out right now that I like making content for. Fortnite's really the only thing that I can enjoy myself making content for. I love it when there's updates. It gets me excited. I love it when somebody finds a new exploit. It gets me excited. I love when really cool games and creative comes out. It gets me really excited. Honestly, the only thing that I think will like really save Fortnite or bring it back to how it was a couple of years ago is when the new modded stuff comes to Fortnite with Unreal Engine. I hope, I really, really, really hope, and I think that's a rumor right now, but I want it because content honestly is just kind of meh. As I said, I do these videos every now and then. It just kind of lets me get some stuff off my chest and it's just nice just to be like, hey, I wish this would change and maybe somebody will hear me and hopefully it will happen. Most of the time it doesn't, but maybe I can try. I do want to say thank you Fortnite for changing my life and giving a huge platform for myself which is you know awesome and amazing but please i know i've said it many times please tune skill based please make a rank system and give us new stuff instead of just remodeled retextured the last fortnite event that happened with jonesy and the interstellar guy saving the map or whatever that was amazing probably top three of like my favorite fortnite events it was so cool and i feel like the gameplay we got out of that with that big change it just really wasn't that exciting. Plus, frick, give us back snipers. I was going to make a trick shotting sniper series and I can't even do that anymore. Frick. Rest in peace, all my trick shot homies. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I know I have these crying videos every now and then, but I just like to talk sometimes. Code dumb with the Fortnite Adam shop. Don't be dumb. Use code dumb. And again, 1% merch is only available for a little bit longer. The link is in the description. And go check out 1% too. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video whenever it is. Epic, please help us. Peace. Oh, Bucky, she's in the rock. Wait, I think she's glitched. Oh no, she has the shoddy too, and I can't shoot her. This is no good, random. Oh, this sucks. <laughs> Come on, what is this, bro? Well, they're here. There's, there are people.